the popular was able to catch up with Mr. Siddharth with the Muni, one of the past players of Anand College. Welcome, Mr. Siddharth. Uh, when you talk about the Battle of the Maroons, what uh, comes into your head? Well, in my time it was certainly the match uh, that the player looked forward to at the end of the season. And uh, the Anand and Anand was fiercely competitive. And I must say, in the five years I played, Nalanda had fantastic sides and he was always uh, under a lot of pressure to perform. Um, and we had a great match every year because we had super players on either side. And uh, it was something every player looked for. The Battle of the Maroons has been known to be a breeding ground for a lot of national cricketers. What do you think it differentiates from the rest of the league matches? Well, as you know, Anand and Nalanda have produced more test cricketers than I think any other school has. Uh, I know Anand has, I think, maybe got the most number of test cricketers so far. And uh, that was because Anand and Nalanda was a breeding ground for cricket. Both schools promoted cricket in a big way and we had some of the best young talent during that period. Uh, I must say now it's a lot more diluted and there are a lot more cricketers from the outstations coming in, which is a good sign for international cricket. But during our time, certainly Anand and Nalanda produced some of the best cricketers. So the whole culture of our schools was uh, promoted through to it. And uh, that's why we produce such people. And uh, as, a, as a young cricketer, Taking that leap from two-day cricket to five-day cricket to national level, was was there any sort of difference physically and uh, mentally? Oh yeah, so five-day cricket is an entirely different ball game. The demands of uh, five-day cricket are totally different, uh, much much tougher. Test cricket is really the test, and uh, from two-day cricket it was difficult to shift to five-day cricket. But then we had three-day cricket as well, which was part of uh, part of our. Uh, international, uh, I mean domestic cricket, the first class cricket. So, yes, but as, as the records prove, a uh, lot of Anandians, uh, you know, got into test cricket very, very fast. So, college cricket was very, very important. Out of the college big matches, there are only a few that have moved from three-day game to a three-day game. That being the Battle of the Blues and uh, maybe the uh, Jaffna Central match which is uh, up north. Uh, do you advise the cricket community to promote the three-day game because uh, it will make it easier for the for the cricketers to move on? Well, as far as decisions are concerned, three-day cricket would obviously have a better chance of uh, bringing about a decision. Three-day cricket is essential if you want to look at the big, you know, the big game, the test game. So. Three-day cricket is important, but I must say, uh, in our time, even in two days, we sometimes have decisions. You know? So the, the, the quality of cricket was good. It was a lot more entertaining. And uh, what two-day cricket did then was to promote decisions. You know, you declared faster. You made the game a little faster. The three-day game stretches it.